It's see, obviously no, no shame in losing 2-1 away to Manchester City, but the manner of the defeat made it quite tough to take, didn't it? Um, yeah, I think like looking back on the result at the end, obviously it was devastating to concede so late um, a penalty, but uh, it feels a bit like a missed opportunity because it's going to be rare in that situation. You go to the Etihad and you're drawing and they've got 10 men for a lot of the game, so it's a little bit... Um, yeah, leaves a bad taste in your mouth because it feels like we definitely could have got something. Yeah, I mean, you came on with a quarter of an hour to play, um, and in most cases, when you're coming on against a team who's played with ten men for most of the game, you'd be expecting tired bodies. Maybe we'd have more of the ball, but Man City is just a different beast, isn't it? Um, yeah, it's completely different. I mean, they went down to ten men, but the game didn't really change that much. That's, I mean, that's I'm saying that that's a massive credit to them. I think any other team in the league, if they get ten men, the game will change, but. It didn't really change too much playing Manchester City with 10 men. So, um, yeah, this is, look, it's a frightening squad, for a frightening team, but, but we, this game isn't going to define our season. So, um, but at the same time, it still feels like a bit of a missed opportunity. This showing how much progress we've made, though, the fact that we're so upset to have lost by one goal at the Etihad. Yeah, of course. I mean, I lost one goal against Arsenal, one goal against Man City. Um, it's been, look, we've been competitive in every single game, and I think that's all you can ask at the start of the season. Um, if anyone said to us we'd have this start at the start of the season we'd have bit their hand off do you know what I mean so um, look we can't be two down uh, we, are, we aren't one in a couple of games but the performance levels have been there Manchester United on Sunday it's quite a tasty final fixture before we uh, stop for the World Cup yeah big game I mean my new coming to coming to your stadium is huge so um, look it'll be a, it's a nice game to end it on on the Sunday as well um, hopefully the fans will be in a little bit loud and, and, and help us get through it. Um, but we're looking to yeah try and win the game and go into the break on, on a bit of a high. They had a bad result in their last match, but before that they were absolutely flying and um, so much quality throughout that squad. Yeah, and then before that game, it looked like people were saying they turned a bit of a corner. I mean, performance-wise and energy-wise and the, the, the way they was playing, it was it was quite it was quite exciting, especially going forward. So um, look, they had a bit of a blip last week, but I'm sure they want to yeah put that right on Sunday. Harrison Reed's had a fantastic season, but he got his fifth booking on uh, on Saturday, so he's ruled out at the weekend. Um, you must be hoping that your performances so far this season are, are putting you in contention for a start at the weekend. Of course, yeah. I mean, that's all uh, we can all do. I think competition for places, competition to play in the team is healthy, and I think we've had that this season. Um, I've come off the bench in, in every game, um, and whatever I've had to do in, in them situations, whether we're winning, we're losing, trying to get us back in the game, I've... I've tried to do so. Um, look, if the manager if the manager plays me, it'll be my first start, and yeah, I'll just try and do what I normally do. If we win on Sunday, we go into this break a point behind Manchester United in the table, and whether or not you think it's too early to start paying too much attention to the table, that's a fantastic position to be in. Oh, massive! I mean, uh, if that, if that is the case, if we do go into the break a point behind Manchester United. It's been an, an immense start of the season, um, and everyone deserves deserves a lot of credit. So. Look, um, we're building up this week for, for a big, big performance on Sunday and yeah, hopefully we get it. What's your thoughts on the break? I suppose on the one hand, because we've started the season so well, you kind of like to keep going, but is part of you looking forward to a little rest and, and watching the World Cup? Yeah, a little bit. It's, a, it's kind of a unique situation. Um, I, I'm looking forward to, I don't know, just like a bit of a change in schedule, um, a bit of time away uh, in, the, in the winter period. It could be nice, but I just... And I will be watching the World Cup, yeah, because I love football, so I will be watching a lot of it. So, I don't know, it, might, it could be good. I mean, the first game back on Boxing Day will be weird and, and hard, but um, yeah, I'm looking forward to it.